hundred years ago, a new company was formed. From the very beginning, our founder adopted a policy which was radically different from his contemporaries and years ahead of its time, as these early products show. H.J. Hines decided then what some companies are only deciding now, that if you have the required recipe skills, nature's way is almost always the best. In those early days, the Heinz approach was based on intuition. Today, it's backed by a wealth of experience and research. Yet the founder's guiding principles remain unchanged. The concern over the quality of the ingredients. The quality of the recipe, the natural taste. There's nothing like the rich, tomatoey taste of Heinz ketchup. In those early days, other manufacturers favoured opaque glass jars as a way of obscuring occasionally dubious contents. Since H.J. Heinz had nothing to hide, he pioneered the use of clear glass as his way of proving the purity of his products. This honest-to-goodness approach was considered uncommercial by his competitors, and for years, they resisted the opportunity to follow his lead. But H.J. Hines believed in his products and his principles. He personally introduced his early products to Fortnum and Mason, who sold them as a delicacy. How times do change. Once many people had too little food, their diets obviously lacked balance. Today, perhaps, the temptation is to eat too much and too often. And while choice is clearly desirable, an embarrassment of choice can make choosing more difficult. In the post-war years, when rationing and shortages were ending, nutritional experts tended to concentrate in building diets up, while food advertisers were happy to develop the natural swing of self-indulgence. Eat up all your crumpets. Healthy and eating yes, seemed like a killjoy concept. Go on, have another one. No son of mine drinks in arms. Oh, Tim, you must. I cooked especially. Don't listen to him. Give him some more gas. With the frame. <laughs> one way to a man's heart attack is through his stomach. You don't look at all well, Jim. Are you sure they're giving you enough to eat? In its own way, Heinz has helped make good fresh salad more popular by making it more enjoyable and interesting. No salad is ever going to be fooled by a thin, runny salad cream. Because no other salad cream has the unique taste of Heinz. And more recently, in response to the demand for reduced calorie foods, Heinz have introduced a separate new range called, appropriately, Weight Watchers from Heinz. Heinz have a new range of foods for people who are watching their weight. It's not fatty, just straightforward, everyday food with a full measure of flavour. The only thing it lacks is a few calories. Which might help tip the scales in your favour. Weight Watchers from Heinz. Today, there's a new generation of mums who know that a balanced diet is best for everyone, right from the start. Heinz have been saying so for years. They're a fruit juice which has been set into a natural jelly. Today, we provide valued guidance to the professionals and seek their opinions in return. You could say it's a very healthy dialogue. And no added sugar, too. That's right. Oh, good. And do you add salt? To oh, yes. No salt adds to any of the baby foods and obviously no artificial preservatives. Or and of course, it isn't confined to the professionals. The link between diet and health is now widely recognised. I check the labels on all the things I buy because I feel it's important because the nutrition, especially at my age. A 
good diet, lots of fiber, wholesome food, and no additives, or a reduction in additives, because some things need them. I've cut down on salt and sugar recently. I'm much more aware of it now. I look after the family's diet. Um, I think it's important that we all cut down on sugar and on salt in the food that we eat, uh, that we all have more, eat more fiber, um, and that we eat foods with less additives and less preservatives in them. I've got a child of nine and a child of six, and I'm very, very concerned about what they eat. After all, there is an old saying, we are what we eat in moderation and eating. For any food company today, consumer feedback is vitally important. At Heinz, we receive hundreds of letters every month. Many ask for dietary or recipe advice. We answer all of them. After all, communication is a two-way street. And we want to hear what our customers think or like. So we ask around 100,000 different people every year for comments. Even if they don't know who's made the food they're tasting. And we don't confine it to the general public. Every week, the company's own directors are involved in product tasting sessions, focusing on flavor, aroma, color, consistency, quality, and above all, taste. That way, quality control starts right at the top. Now those beans there, I thought, were just a little soft. The texture's good again. The texture's very good. Heinz are constantly seeking ways to improve the nutritional qualities of their foods. But any change in taste must be acceptable to the consumer, as any of their nutrition experts will tell you. We've always made it our business to take nutrition seriously. For some years now, we've been reducing the levels of added salt and sugar in a wide range of our products. In fact, all Heinz baby foods are made without added salt, and the majority without added sugar. And all of this must be accomplished without losing that distinctive Heinz taste. We've always supported the consumer's right to know by means of clear and informative labelling. In fact, we have provided full nutrition information ahead of any government regulations on all our labels. You could say they are as clear as our founder's glass jars. Heinz are very conscious of today's healthy eating advice, and you probably know that our most popular varieties of beans, pasta and soup are naturally low in fat, a great plus nowadays. And beans, of course, give us more dietary fibre per serving than most other foods. The continuing popularity of Heinz products over the years, from one generation to the next, couldn't have been achieved if we hadn't have always strived to put the consumer first. We believe you're entitled to good tasting, nutritious, value for money food that fulfills the needs of both you and your family. Our focus in this presentation has been to show you how we achieve nutritional excellence and great taste. These are the basics of our philosophy at Heinz and we intend to continue to apply this philosophy to every product that we sell. We hope you found this presentation helpful in more fully understanding the values of Heinz which brings us bang up to date with a company which started life even before governments became concerned about contents, but whose ideas of quality control, recipes, taste and purity are as appropriate today as they were revolutionary a hundred years ago. A company which set the standards voluntarily. A company called Heinz. In today's food conscious, health-conscious, diet-conscious world. Trust Heinz to play their part in providing a variety of good-tasting, value-for-money foods to make life more satisfying, whatever your age or your circumstances. And to do it in a way that's unique to Heinz and known to most through the products and the advertising. <laughs>
school of this iron shoe, lad. When me and Bobby Charm were unbatting against Australia, stumps were underwater. After we'd had our iron soup, we scored 300 in half an hour. Anyway, Bobby Charlton's a footballer. Afternoon, John.